Welcome, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. This is the Learn and Cover Music. I hope everybody is having a lovely November. I hope everybody eat their belly full for Thanksgiving last week. Today is Wednesday, you know, on the 29th. Yeah, come back to do a little video today now, you know. So, um, we have a, have a video to, to do today. I want to extract a vocal. Someone asked me to do our next video again, showing them how to explain myself, how to extract a vocal from scratch. I want to keep it under 15 minutes for the most. So the day the plugin we're going to use today is a plugin from a site called Vox, Vox Ingo. Vox Ingo. This is a free plugin. This is a free plugin, people. You know what I mean? These are techniques I normally use when I can't get a vocal inside a inside a Adobe Audition. You know what I mean? I'm be really using this plugin inside a studio one but you can use this same plugin inside of any door right now you know what I mean? you can use it in reaper you can use it in um in um in i guess pro tools you know what i mean because i saw aax there too you know what i mean so you can just use the plugin the plugin is is a the name of the plugin is vox look at here vox ingo m s e d free no smart man think people you know what i mean if you have a 64 bit, you click 64 bit. If you have a 32 bit, you click the 32 bit. You know what I mean? If you want to use the VST, VS3, you can use the VS3 or for Mac. You use it, it can work in Mac and it can work in Windows and it can work in Pro Tools because it's an AAX here already. See? So basically, this plugin here will extract the vocal for your inside uh, the studio but you need the original instrumental people you know what i mean you need the original instrumental how i get my instrumental i go up on a site called itunes you know what i mean itunes normally had the instrumental i went on itunes um last night and i saw a, i saw a acapella from 2000 and i think it's 2009 Really a couple of song from 2009 and the artist name is Wasp. I purchased it, I purchased, I purchased it and the album came with an instrumental. This is the, you know, Wasp on, on this, the, look at here. But still Remember that song, Wasp? Or if you know this artist name, Wasp, S-W-A-S-P, you know what I mean, Unfair Officer. So we're going to extract this plug, this, this a cappella. So. I downloaded the folder and I installed the folder already. I have Unfair Officer, seeing, and I have Unfair Original, seeing. First thing begin, you have to open up your, the program you want to use. What I like to use, people, I like to insert the, the original song, the original song. I like to insert the original song, seeing. <coughs> and I, do like, I like to put it <coughs> in bar two. Original song, yeah. You put it in bar two. I like to keep the song in bar two. See? Then now, after that, now, I like, you know what I mean? I go listen to the, the, the track. I go like, like go to the middle part. I want to like, I don't want to like copyright, copyright track. I want to play the beginning of the song with the man, like in city woods, you know? So we go listen to the track. I'm not qualified for the nine to five. So is that dance me? I keep text some nick up on consignment. I'm in black the street. Only well, here in this track already how it's song in. You know what I mean? It have no plugin on it on the track. Well, let's see, insert have no plugin. Next stop now, we want to insert insert the instrumental or the version. You know? And I like to put it in the same way I line it up in bar two. See? What I like to do now, I like to zoom out. In Studio One, why I like to use Studio One, is easy. I like to zoom out with this. With, put my hand the cursor on the bar 10 and zoom out like that. And zoom in. Or you can use this. But I like most like to use this. You know what I mean? I like to zoom out like that. Just like that. When I zoom out like that, you have to line up the song together. What I like to do now, before before I line up the song together, I play the two tracks together. I'm going like you, let me. You see, 
It has no instrument, no plugin on the on the instrumental. This is the instrumental here. Listen to the track by itself. Listen. Seeing, I like to do that. Now, if I uncheck, uh, if I uncheck the solo like this here now, if I uncheck solo like this. You two track on the play together, then they go start a song like messy, messy, loud noise. I'm not qualified for the nine to it's so in loud. Right now, the vocal is not ex extract. See, what I like to do now, like I said, I like to zoom out and line it up. You got to line up the track together. You got to line it up together. You know what I mean? See, like how the beginning is? Look for the beginning at the peak. You're looking at this wave right here. See this thing underneath here? This here? You want to line up this here with this. So you drag it, you drag it until you see it close to like line up. You, you zoom out again and you want to know this part here and this part here line up. See, I, I think I get it on the first try, you know? Right, it is line up right there. So you zoom out now. You zoom out, zoom out, and then you go back to the next part here now, like right in the beginning here, and you see if it line up. Everything kind of looking, looking the same, you know. Line up, you know what I mean? And what I like to do, I like to go along in the back to make sure all the way down to the end to see if the if the last part zoom out and see if the last part here line up. Be looking for the speak here. Everything look looking kind of perfect, you know. All right. Next thing I like to do is go to the plugin that we say we're gonna use, M S E D Vox Lingo. Like the folder here, Vox Lingo, and you insert it onto the instrumental track. Now you listen to this here, people, you know. When I play, press back play, and you're gonna see the the the, the waveform. It playing if you play an instrumental we just play the instrumental. Simple or no, this is simple. This can work on any instrumental. But I'm gonna tell you something, people. The reason why a lot of people having trouble having trouble with getting a vocal because the producers nowadays, the, these newer nowadays producer engineers, they're not mixing the rhythm right. They just put in that vocal on the rhythm and they're mixing it. You know what I mean? The uh, producers that actually mix the rhythm, put the vocal in the middle, put stuff to the side. Anytime you get a vocal, how I know when a vocal could um when how I know how to, how a vocal is is mixed good is by listening to the rhythm. If the rhythm is sung and bassy bassy or the instrument is sung and like Jumble up, jump your belly here in the 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 the, the high heart, your belly here in the instrument. Then I know, then you know the, this 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 this. You know this this vocal and mix good. See like artists like Michael Jackson and <coughs> Rihanna. These artists actually are professional engineers mixing their track. Beyonce. If you go to a fly by night artist like one of them, sorry, 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 like. People who just mixing track and just put it on the internet and put out an instrument and hope to get the vocal from it, it won't you won't get it. Bass bass heavy instrument you will not get it. You know what I mean? You will not get the a bass heavy instrumental. You have to look, you listen to because if you listen to play music and you want to remix, you must know who makes the track good and who can mix. Is that some producers producers out they can't really mix? You know what I mean? They just have a, they just have to build with them, but they just can't mix. You know what I mean? They, that way they need a next engineer. That's most of them a, 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 a producer now. Make the beat and they send it, send it, send the track to an engineer, a real engineer that can put it together. Transform the, the beat into something. You know what I mean? That's how 
Rihanna and Michael Jackson and them, that how they transcend their career. You know what I mean? So, by hearing this rhythm here now, I know this this track mix good. Because I hear in piano, I hear in a lot of instrument and instruments. It is something like squash. You know what I mean? So, that's the reason when I mix a track, only hear my remix on the internet. Why is the song so good? You know what I mean? Because I, I, know, I know the capability to make a rhythm song good. You know what I mean? So, we are the, we're using the plugin right now, people. You know what I mean? So, the most important thing here, people, with this plugin is the Flip 180. This Flip 180 is going to get you the vocal. We're going to show you right now gonna by doing it. Right now, the track playing. We're going to play the track again without pl with the flip. Listen to the track without pressing flip. It's going to song jumble up. Not qualified for the nine to five. So it's now, we're going to click flip. 180 that's what i'm gonna do click one flip 180 leave everything at zero zero only thing you're touching is flip 180 now listen how, listen how the vocal come out of the come out of the rhythm but remember i line up the rhythm everything i already you know line up the instrumental with the, the original song see if you download a track on youtube and you get the original instrument, it's not gonna sound good. Trust me when I say that. It might sound good, it might not sound good. But this is the original chuck and instrumental. See, this is a regular chuck I'm using from Wasp. I don't want to copyright infringement that they're using like samples of the man's song. So, show you guys it can happen. See, listen. I'm not qualified for the nine to five. So, is that dance? Me not keep text some nigga from right now. It ain't song in like a line of right. So, we just go back in. Zoom out and, and see if we can play with it until it's had a song good. See? Yeah. Line it up again. I think that is it right here. Now listen to it. This is not the track song. I'm not qualified for the nine to five. So is that dance me not keep text some nick up on consignment. I'm in black the streets. The people them come out for me. But by the time I look up here, G, I'm not qualified for the nine to five. So is that dance, me not keep text some nick up on consignment. I'm in black the streets. The people them come out for leap. But by the time I look up here, G, I'm not qualified for the nine to five. So is that dance, me not keep text some nick up on consignment. I'm in black the street. See, easy that vocal come out. And I could do that with many other tracks. Not every not every instrumental and original song will work. Most of the time my producers these days now. When you're recording an artist, seeing they like to play, they like to play a lot of claps, a lot of a lot of hi hats in the rhythm with all the beat. So that helps some artists get vibes by voicing. Then now the artist, then the, the producer come and they slap on the rhythm together. So it's hard for them to like get a clean a cappella. But this a cappella is good. You know what I mean? This to me is song good to me. This can use in, in one in a remix. Seeing? So that's how you get vocal from my from my from my original track. See, download Vox Mendo M S E D people, you know what I mean, and you got to go, you know what I mean, and the the the, 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 the person that comment on the thing say, explain it. This is my best explanation I, I could give you guys, you know what I mean. This is a plugin easy to use, very easy. It's free. You don't have to pay for this. Just go on the internet, download it on any site. And just try it in your, in, in your production. And most of the time you get the, the a cappella. Seeing there's a, 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 a tr original track from 2009. And it's 2007, like eight, eight, nine years ago. And I, and I did it. I just randomly choose it. So, hope you guys understand what I'm talking about. This is, I'm out. And I mean, I hope you guys comment and leave a thing. Share my videos all over the place. And I mean, let them know that I'm here to stay, you know. Yeah. You got to everybody.